Firstly, I'd like to acknowledge that we find ourselves in strange and inevitably difficult times, times that none of us could have predicted, and we'll be forever grateful to the amazing NHS workers, carers and scientists who are at the forefront of this COVID-19 epidemic. But what about when it comes to our businesses, our careers and the UK economy? Well, I believe, I know, that adversity can spark creativity and we need to be agile and flexible in our work and businesses in order to survive and potentially even to thrive. Many of us will find ourselves with more time and more flexibility. The shackles of a nine to five or perhaps even an eight to eight work schedule in an office have disappeared. So those long office days on a cycle of back to back meetings are finally on pause. I frequently crave the time to slow down, take a break and get some space. And I know that I'm not alone. And this is exactly what we've been presented with. We have the time to slow down, be considered about how we spend our time and make much more conscious decisions. So this podcast comes in two parts. Firstly, I will share what I've been doing on a day to day basis to stay focused, take positive action and to live more consciously. I found working from home very difficult when I started my first business, let's be frank, which is why I invested in an office as soon as I could afford to. Um, I've been through some challenging times in these four walls and I hope I have some learnings to pass on from that experience. And secondly, I will share what I've worked on, what I've been working with my husband over the last 72 hours. So we've had to completely pivot our fitness business. Um, I will share what I intend to focus on and some ideas of what you can be doing over the coming weeks. But before I do, I'd like to share just one thing, that control is an illusion. And once the illusion of control has been lifted, that's actually very freeing. And that is exactly what has happened. We've been shown, it's been demonstrated to us that we do not have control. So rather than focusing on what we can't control, let's focus on what we can control, how we can take positive action and to continue to be fluid and to support each other on a daily basis.